Hey y'all my friends, this is Ebony Nine Four Thousand coming to you another movie review. I am reviewing Seed of Chucky from 2004. This is this is a sequel in the long running series of Chucky e films. Once you're not familiar with it, then you're probably normie as hell. Basically, these film films are about a killer killer doll, but that's by a serial killer. Later on in the sequels, he, he he got married to a to a doll, but that's by a serial killer. That sounds, that sounds like Jennifer Tilly. And also, so they have a kid that resurrects them. So basically, it's a family of monsters, monsters trying to bond together. And, and basically, these possessed these dolls always basically come across like us like it's like a very familiar face in this series. Chucky's wife is played by a, the actress Jennifer Tilly. The end. Brad Dorf plays Chucky. Not quite sure who plays their kid. It, but it's kind of weird here because, like, it, season four is not very. We don't talk about gender identity that much at that time period. It's kind of weird. Basically, it's like he's like the kid has no genitals, and he's just kind of like, like I he's like I feel like a boy. That's so a girl. I'm like, oh crap! This really got up to the whole on on freaking gender flu with stuff very quick. Like another like gender into crap of seventy five genders. <laughs> I'm not sure what's going on with that anymore. I don't go. Oh, on freaking you can live to tick tock that often then then i don't i don't care about cancel i'm just joking about this stuff i just uh but anyway anyway basically basically they're trying to basically get into different bodies and and chucky's wife is trying to get in in, in the in actress's body so basically she's trying to really generate fertility what i'm mentioning here is like like it's very clever overall they joke about them having the same voice by having I mean, Jennifer really talk on or having Jennifer really talk on the phone, on with with this one an agent with one um I think Asian of hers. Meanwhile, Chucky's wife is talking at the same time. She's being the agent is confused. <laughs> it was along with stuff such as like, she's like I like the fake outs. The opening was great where it's like you see like the the, the, the Chucky's kid being born, his first kills was I think, or it's just kind of I like I like memories of like of like Chucky. But overall, I like the AA jokes they have, where it's like, we're addicted, like, basically Chucky's like, he was kid, okay, we're addicted to killing, like, 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 like we'll try to stop, like, they make a lot of basically, like, killing, like, jokes, but it's like, it's like AA, but with killing jokes. Oh, because it's just funny as hell. Oh, there's, like, one part in there, in there, in there too, which is, it, like, it didn't, it didn't make sense, where you just kind of, like, I'm looking for someone hot to play version of Mary, like, it, like, basically, it's someone cast Richard type thing, like, you're calling Jennifer Tilly illy, illy not hot. I would buy his tier, his tier, but I'm thinking he can, he's kind of, kind of an asshole. So basically, and the movie agrees, so he's dead. <laughs> and uh, the ending is very weird. Weird. Um, overall, it's a very enjoyable film. It's very funny, very well written. Brad Dorf does a good job as usual. As well as it was Chucky, Chucky, and give it dinosaur approval, and I give it roughly a. I give it a. Give it a I'm going to give it like an 8.2 8 out of 10. That's really what we're watching. Have a day. Chomp, chomp. See you later.